I have represented victims of car accidents with semis and other big trucks for over 35 years. These accidents could have been avoided. Each week, I will share a tip on how to make the roadway safer. These involve steps that need to be taken by semi drivers, car drivers, as well as trucking companies. My tip this week deals with steps that professional commercial motor vehicle drivers should take to avoid road rage. Now, truckers on the average drive over 100,000 miles a year if they're over the road truckers. And if you're driving that many miles, then you are going to be confronted with situations that give rise to road rage. And I know because I hear enough from you, from the truckers, on a regular basis about sometimes your hatred or anger towards four-wheelers, drivers of motor vehicles, SUVs, cars, and how angry you get with them and that you believe that a lot of the wrecks that are on the highway between semis and cars are caused by these car drivers. When a car does pull in front of you and cut you off, I know how frustrating that is. And I've actually ridden in trucks and semis. I've driven semis. And I can tell you, it happens. So now, you have, you, now you're faced with how do I react to that? I've personally handled cases where a semi drivers have lost their cool and have engaged in aggressive driving, which then resulted in serious injuries. I had one case where a semi driver was cut off by a car. So a car pulls in front of a semi driver and cuts him off. And the car, the truck was leaving distance between itself and the vehicle in front of it, but then the car whips in there, semi driver was angry, gets right up on the tail of the car. The car then brake checks the semi. Nobody is going to win in that situation and nobody did win in that situation. So then the semi driver lays on the horn, flips them off. Then they go back and forth down the highway, according to witnesses, and you're gambling with 40 tons of steel if you're in a car. If you're that person in the car, you're in danger of dying. The semi driver then gets mad, chases the car, car takes off, goes down on an exit ramp to get away from the semi. And honest to God, the semi actually takes off from the highway, goes through the grassy median, down, and hits the car on the exit ramp. Now, I am guarantee you, if you had talked to that trucker before all this happened, or afterwards, he would have told you that that was ridiculous and that was something that should not be done, that's dangerous, and not worthy of losing your livelihood, of driving a truck and losing your CDL, to do something that stupid. But in the heat of the moment, that's exactly what happened. So if you're a truck driver, you're gonna be faced with these situations that are potential road rage or aggressive driver situations. Uh, you're gonna have cars that do things that, that, that upset you. When you're faced with these issues or these confrontations with other drivers, ignore it. It's not worth it. Get home safe. Let these people get home safe. Don't escalate it by being aggressive back. Try to keep your stress level down. Get a good night's rest, drive fresh, drive alert, drive defensively.